the artwork that I do uh, is figurative and I like telling stories with the artwork um, rather than just having an object that someone can look, look at uh, there is usually a good story behind it I tend to be sarcastic and sometimes the title uh, tells the story and you can either understand it or not uh, and then you can bring your own story into it uh, the piece that we were just looking at has got three ducks and a frog and the title of that is Five Bucks on the Frog where you have two betting on one duck and a frog who are in confrontation. Um, the piece of uh, taking Picasso and Duchamp for a ride, both those artists used bicycle parts to, uh, to do their art. And there are other bicycle pieces that I've done that are called performing art and hanging art. And uh, there's some others that I can't recall the names of, but they all tend to, uh, to have a story behind them. Um, I work in found metal. However, I like to use the materials and the story that they can tell. Uh, I don't bend metal. I tend to use pieces that are curved. The, the, the ducks and the frog are made from pieces of pipe that have been cut up. There are pieces that I've done where I've used leaf springs from automobiles which have a curve to them already. Uh, the bicycles themselves had curves and I used the curves of those without bending anything to uh, achieve the images. There's just something about what man has already done in, in building his uh, objects that tends to have nice lines that can be used and uh, reused to tell stories. Looking for the materials to make the objects is, is the biggest challenge in, in building a figure out of existing curved pieces. Um, one of the uh, challenges there is, is collecting the uh, materials in order to do a piece of artwork um, in the fashion that I do. You, you go to a junkyard and you search around and look for some piece of metal that uh, strikes you as having a good uh, shape. Uh, I have a pile of leaf springs right now which I uh, have dedicated to figures uh, and I have pipe that, uh, large diameter pipe that I use to do the, uh, the birds like the small ducks and I have a heron out in the yard. Uh, unfortunately there's some other pieces that have been sold so it can't be shown. Uh, and that's where my materials come from. The uh, Fall Foliage Art Studio Tour is something that I'm participating for the first time uh, this year, uh, although my wife took part last year. And I'm looking forward to it, and if I get a chance, I hope to be able to do some uh, new pieces between now and October.